And these are the visuals of uh, Prime Minister Modi with the 15th President of India, India's first tribal president, Draupadi Murmu, who has uh, won the election after comfortably defeating opposition's candidate Yashwan Sinha. All right, uh, this is the top uh, story that we are uh, breaking on uh, Mirror now. Draupadi Murmu has won the presidential elections of 2022 and will now succeed incumbent Ramnath Kovind to become the country's 15th president and most importantly, India's first tribal president, uh, ruling NDA's Draupadi Murmu and opposition's Yashwant Sinha were pitted against each other in the contest. Uh, Yashwant Sinha, who conceded defeat, congratulated Draupadi Murmu on her victory and wrote that she functions as the custodian of the constitution without fear or favor. Uh, we are getting the first reaction from Draupadi Murmu's family. Her brother spoke to Times Network. Let's first take a look at that reaction. Joining with me is the younger brother of Draupadi Murmu. Uh, sir, you have to say that 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 you have to हो सकता है उसका भाई का नाते मेरे को बहुत खुशी है क्या आपको सर उम्मीद था कि इतने बहुमत से आप लोग जीतेंगे ये तो उम्मीद नहीं था लेकिन जितना आदमी से वो हर जगह जाके संसद से और एमएलए से मिला उसी टाइम से पता चला कि दीदी जीत जाएगी करके उसके बाद अगला प्लान क्या है कब आप लोग जा रहे हैं दिल्ली राजधानी हम लोग 23 तारीख का टिकट कर चुका है दिल्ली 23 तारीख को जा रहे हैं सर आखिरी सवाल जिस तरीके से सुबह से रायरंगपुर के वासी यहां पे मौजूद थे सपोर्ट कर रहे थे नाच रहे थे गाना कर रहे थे उनके लिए क्या कहना चाहेंगे बस उनके तो वो उन लोग बहुत खुशी था इसलिए उन लोग को भी बधाई देना चाहता हूं कि दीदी का मतलब खुशी में मतलब उन लोग जुड़ा हुआ था इसलिए उन लोग को बहुत बहुत बधाई all right, so that was the reaction uh, that uh, we were getting as far as the uh, big update uh, is concerned. I'm joined by a special guest, uh, uh, Pankaj Nayak, uh, on the broadcast. Uh, Mr. Nayak, thank you for uh, speaking to Mirror now. For the benefit of our viewers, how do you see this development? And according to you, how and why does representation matter in politics when we see Draupadi Murmu, who's India's first tribal president? Uh, thank you so much for having me uh, with you. At the uh, uh, this is like big news for us, for Adivasi, for state of Odisha, that for the first time, Odisha and a uh, woman from Odisha has been elected to the top constitutional post. We are really elated. Uh, yes, we are uh, happy because of political representation that we have, you know, got in this election at least. But uh, there are some concerns, I mean, that remains with us because uh, the debate that we are going to have uh, in future that you know how this representation that we are talking about, that we are lauding about, is going to translate into action, because in the past, uh, uh, the, the preceding uh, the president of India has also been one, uh, one uh, has also been from the you know one of the uh, uh, one of the communities which has which has been historically denied you know representation, but at the same time we also saw the rise of you know all sort of atrocities, all sort of you know uh, constitutional. Uh, I mean, their constitutional rights have been, you know, time and again, it's been uh, taken down by the uh, very uh, disp dispensation itself. So this remains a uh, matter of, you know, uh, I mean, uh, something that we are really interested to see how it unfolds. But I would I also like to, you know, uh, raise uh, some of the points over here that this also throws, you know, some of the important, you know, uh, uh, I mean, uh, opportunities for travel at least because this is very first time in the history of India that you know a tribal has been given 
uh, such a big responsibility of the state of a nation. So the community is looking forward to it. I would uh, like to see that, you know, how this uh, constitutional post, the top constitutional post, would translate into action. All right. Uh, thank you, Mr. Nayak, for making time and speaking to Mirror now on this big story.